Hello buddy, I'm doing a Five Nights at Freddy's free challenge. It's not FNAF AR this time. Now I'm going to be going into Night 5. And what's actually going to make this a bit difficult is that, well, on the normal run through, you'll be resetting everything. But I'm not allowed to use a single reboot of the ventilation system. So, you know what happens when you don't restart the ventilation systems? Well, you'll get a quite occasional blackouts. It'll flash and you'll get occasional blackouts, which can be pretty distracting. And also, spring trap gains the ability... You'll start hallucinating um, multiple spring traps around the building, so... Um, you won't be able to tell what the real one is unless you're keeping good track of them. However, you won't get vent hallucination, so that's one thing about it. So, um, starting off, you won't get a... I'm not allowed to do a reboot all either because that's kind of cheating because it'll be resetting the ventilation as well. So, I'll, if there's a audio and a camera error at once, I'm just going to have to reset them um, separately. That's, that's how it's going to work. So, um, I just want to keep track of spring trap. It's going to be easy for the first hour or so until... Uh, in game hour until the ventilation goes off Hi. it'll be a normal playthrough until then and then you know the action will spice up after that so just keeping my uh things under under control here keeping spring trap in places that is um about uh, between seven to ten is you know good eight nine or ten but the thing is though if you have an eight seven or six you get the advantage of that being sealed and it's just one vent bit Vents are too, aren't too much of an issue unless you're playing Nightmare Aggressive Mode. And I've done a good few flick-ups there because... Um, Balloon Boy makes his first appearance at 1am. Now, this is a voiceover after I've done it, so... Um, this um, I did complete it, and here's when the ventilation error kicks in. So this is when things really start to spice up. So, um, this is an after recording because this is on the console port as well, if I didn't bring that up. But it's in the title. Um, Xbox One Edition, you can tell by the... B and A beside the map toggle and the play audio. So, see, this isn't uh, the easiest situation here. We got a few errors going on, but um, you can just tell with the e um, this heavy static whenever you use the lure to indicate if. And saying he's an event, I'm I'm able to do both of them no problem right now. And you know, with this run actually, the hallucinations weren't too much of an issue. Now, at one point in it, I do get um, I do mistakenly get jump scared by Phantom Foxy, but he was in event, so luckily he didn't do a big jump through the building. Um, so that was, that was good. He was in, um, I'm pretty sure Cam 11 when it comes to events, but I don't remember entirely, but, you know, I had it all done and whenever the jump scare happened, he was in events, so he didn't just jump down to like four or something. That would have been pretty tricky if that did happen because there'd be hallucinations throughout, probably, and that wouldn't have ended well, so... You see, there's all the black guys, and here's when the jump scare happened with Phantom Foxy, though he was an event, thankfully, so, um, I got that all done with, and, um, he didn't make a jump for the building, because if you didn't know, um, whenever a Phantom jump scares you and say, like, he spring traps, you could just make him a, a giant jump, and that's fair, because you messed up, every, every Phantom's avoidable, and, you know, it's not cheating for spring trap, because you, you messed up, you know, you, every Phantom encounter could be avoided if you're with fast reflexes, um, Phantom Freddy, uh, you know, you don't look at him, and so on. I'm not going to describe all the Phantom mechanics. Uh, you should know that. So, keeping Spring Trap genuinely in, uh, trying to keep him in 8, 9, or 10 the majority of the time, that's, that's like the golden cameras, that's the places you kind of want him to be. And you know, just 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 to because it's a good mini game and it's a very good ending. Um, I'll also just do. Um, I'll also have the mini game ending at, in it as well. You know, whenever you're crying child and you slaughter William. <laughs> oh, and another thing as well is that this was also a uh, bad ending route, so ain't gonna be a good ending run. Uh, this is a bad ending uh, playthrough. You know, I, I genuinely do both of them though a lot. You know, I do tons of FNAF free replays, and just any FNAF game in general. Great to do replays of. So yeah, gen it actually did end uh, very well with an easy win, boy. Um, now, there's a bit here, he was going in a few vents. Uh, there was a part when... Uh, and then here's when I was a bit slow, and Phantom Puppet was in Cam 8, and I got an encounter. But thankfully, Phantom, Fo uh, Phantom Freddy sorry, was... Basically, at the end of his walkthrough of the window, so he didn't get me. And Springtrap was just going in and out through Cam 9's vents, so it was all golden. 
Now here's when I didn't really know what was going on. Uh, I, I wasn't keeping track on whether he was entering or exiting, and that's when I thought I could have messed up, but I didn't. It was all in control. And then the video error came in, which wasn't helping me at all. Yeah, but then after that, I get back in. I would get back into it, and I um everything's all in the control again. Yeah, there was a few instances where he was at camera five, but when he's in camera five, you can do an audio alert with camera eight, so he can actually go from camera five to camera eight. And I knew he was in camera five or below that, but um because of the you know the ambience and Phantom Freddy wasn't by the window, so it had to be spring trap. So doing alert or an audio on camera eight would bring him back. That's something that genuinely happens that it's, it's actually very useful to do it. Because say you got yourself in a mistake wherever you had Springtrap who went down. You can actually let him go to 6 and then 5 and then just bring him back up to 8. which is But that, that comes with the risk of Springtrap being on 5 and jumping to... Uh, being on 8 and jumping to 5 from there. He can, he can do that. Hello. Springtrap has his ways and there are ways I've learned off so I know what I'm doing. And here's basically the end of the challenge. Basically the end of it. Done dusted well. And there's the win. So as I said before, I'm just gonna feature in um, the Crying Child uh, end mini game as well. You can watch this. I'll, I'll, I'll even do a little dub just because I think it'll be good. <laughs> That's silly. So uh, here's Crying Child's voice. Oh, he's rearranged our corpses. <coughs> We have to kill him off. Let's team up. Hey, hey, you little pesky bastard. Oh, there's a turtle in there. William, it's springlock time for you. No, no, I'm gonna fucking shit my pants. I'm actually gonna fucking shit my pants. <laughs> you pesky kids. Think you can stop me? I created from it. <laughs> no, I can't die by my own creations. This is a lie. Got him, good boys. And there we go. There's um, and then you get the ending here as well. So there was, there was, that was a really good challenge. I think I'm gonna do night six as well. Well, that'll be a good bit harder. But you know, gotta get, gotta get, get, get good challenges. They're called challenges for a reason. They're supposed to be difficult. And knowing me, I'll be able, I'll be able to conquer anything at FNAF. Like no offense, I think I could. So um. There was, um, I'm just gonna play the, the ending for it, because it's got the revamped, the remastered soundtrack, non-copyrighted, so I'm gonna leave it in here. Um, there was, there was doing FNAF Freeze Night 5 with uh, a little bit of a twist on it where I wasn't able to reset the ventilation. It's not that hard, but you can try it, you know. It's a good challenge. Um, could, I don't, f no, I did not have aggressive on. I'm pretty sure I didn't have aggressive. I could actually go check it right now. Um, no, I, d I don't think I had aggressive on. Hang on, I'm actually on here. I did not have aggressive on. It was a normal Night 5 run without aggressive on. Um, Night 5 ventilation, so. Fantastic. Um, I think I'm going to do Night 6 as well. Like, ah, uh, soon, I guess. And there it is. Alright, bye.